The princess stays in the picture. It was time for a special art project at Royal Prep, Enchanted Paintings. That's a painting you can magically jump into, Flora explained to Sophia. The fairies assigned painters. Sophia ended up with Princess Hiddelgard. Sophia grabbed her enchanted paintbrush. What should we paint, she asked. A mermaid's cove, of course, Hiddelgard started painting. When the paintings were finished, the fairies told the students the magic words to get in and out. But Hiddelgard was talking and Sophia missed the instructions. Relax, Sophia, Hiddelgard said. I have enchanted paintings all over my castle. I already know all the spells. She waved her wand carelessly and she and Sophia entered an enchanted painting, hanging in the hallway instead of their own. Hiddelgard pretended she'd done it on purpose, but when Sophia wanted to go back, Hiddelgard had to admit the truth. She didn't know the exit spell. The old man in the painting wandered over. He promised to tell them the exit spell, but he asked they'd bring him a dog from one of the other paintings first. The dog was three paintings away. Sophia and Hiddelgard had to travel through all the paintings in between. The first was a picture of a sailing boat. Hiddelgard claimed to know everything about sailing, but she almost sank the boat. Then came a painting of a sleeping bull. Hiddelgard accidentally woke him up, and he chased them right into the next painting. Sophia was tired of know-it-all Hiddelgard. You act as though you know everything, but you don't, she said. Hiddelgard admitted she pretended to know everything so people would like her. Sophia understood how she felt, but she convinced Hiddelgard that it was better just to be yourself. Hearing that helped Hiddelgard figure out a way past the angry bull. She fluttered her fan to distract him while she, Sophia and the dog sneaked past. Finally they were back in the classroom. I'm glad we were partners today, Sophia said. Hiddelgard hugged her. I'm glad we're friends, she said.